Welcome to this tutorial where I'll show you how to sell personalized products fully automated using T in Blue and the Shirty Go Cockpit. Here's an example of a customizable product, and I'll guide you on incorporating such products into your shop to leverage the popularity of personalization. Let's start by installing the T in Blue app in our Shopify store, easily found in the Shopify App Store. Next, create a new product in the Shirty Go Cockpit. Edit it in the designer and enable the Activate Empty Print Area for Personalization by Third Party Apps option. This provides a design free mock up perfect for the D in Blue customizer. Synchronize your new personalized product in your Shopify shop by clicking Sync in the Cockpit's Product tab. Open the T in Blue app in your Shopify admin, go to Artworks, and click New Artwork. Artworks are the designs customers will be able to personalize. Choose a name, set the print area size matching Shirty Go Cockpit's dimensions, found in the Collection Overview. Next, select PNG as RGB as the color profile. Now you can fill the free space with your artwork. For demonstration, I'm adding a graphic and text that is going to be customizable. If you want to know how to create stunning artworks for personalization, you can find a variety of tutorials on D in Blue's YouTube channel. select campaigns, then by Shopify products, and click new campaign. Use the plus button to choose the previously synchronized product from the Shopify catalog, and confirm with create. In step one, select your artwork. And in step two, upload the blank shirty go mockup. I'll demonstrate how to do it manually, but there'll be a feature for it in the future. Upload the mockup, click drag and drop to upload content, and add your artwork in the editor. Ensure the print area's position and size match the Shirty Go Cockpit Designer. Then you can activate the personalization option in your Shopify shop by clicking Launch. Now personalization choices will appear on the product detail page next to our product. Now you already know how to create customizable products using tea in blue, and now I'll show you how to proceed when a product is actually purchased. Once an order for a customizable product is created in Shopify, tea in blue automatically generates additional item properties that you can view in the Shopify admin when checking the order. Among these properties is the automatically generated print file. Now you transfer the order to the cockpit. The cockpit recognizes the tea in blue order and automatically personalizes the product as soon as the print file is provided by tea in blue. According to tea in blue, the print file is completed 5 to 15 minutes after the order is received. If the print file is already available at the time of order transition, personalization occurs immediately. In this case, the file name is displayed in green in the cockpit. If the file is not yet available, the entry is orange, and it checks every 5 minutes to see if the file creation is complete. Once it is complete, personalization is initiated. In the final step, the order must be approved for production. For the first orders, we recommend manual approval so that you can verify that everything is set up correctly. If this is not the case, you can manually adjust the file for current orders as needed, trigger repersonalization, and correct the settings in D in blue for the future. Once everything is set up correctly, you can enable automatic approval by clicking on the gear icon next to your Shopify shop in the cockpit and selecting the option under Personalization Apps. Your automated personalization workflow should now be set up.
SureDigo will then fully automate the printing of the products in the highest quality for you and ship them to your customers. Good luck, and if you have any questions, we are available.